now we'll see next as we manage the finances of the family similarly village cities states country and world also need to have economic management geographically speaking the enterprises related to production distribution and consumption of goods and services in a specific region is called an economy on a global level there are three types of economies so children economics is nothing but the science related to production distribution and consumption of goods and services in a specific region is called an economy children production that means that is very important understood production distribution and consumption how production is to be done what are the resources which is to be used for production how production is to be done after production how distribution is to be done among the people among the population of any country understood there should be equal distribution and there should be wise production that means production should be done in such a way that it can meet the needs of the people understood no one should be deprived of any uh, any resources understood so first production is to be done then distribution of those uh, products and lastly consumption of the goods understood how the consumption of goods is to be done by the population so the all these things which is need to be study under the word economics that is economy that is economy of a country and already we know that india is a developing economy asian countries are developing economy if you compare to western country western countries are developed economy because the production consumption and distribution is totally managed by the capitalist economy understood by the money you can say they are having a balance budget understood why those country are developed country because already they have achieved the level of development which we are supposed to be achieve up to that the uh, in, index or the meter the development meter which already they have achieved because their human development index is higher than asian countries higher than developing countries already in your 8th standard you have already studied about human in development index which means that why those countries are developed countries because they are higher side on the human development index everything is uh, everything is developed literacy level the economic development per capita is capita is high everything is developed compared to our country per capita level is low literacy level is low so all these things are country in the sense asian countries developing countries so in the sense their economy is totally developed on a global level there are three types of economy children all over the world so many countries they have adopted different types of economy for the development understood now we will study how many types of economics are there understood 